Hello everyone, today I have a new finished object video for you, but at the same time it is a free color work toe up sock pattern. As you're not aware, I have knitted a few socks on this channel, so I definitely check it out. And I'm a fan of toe-up socks. And if you've never knitted socks before and you don't want to really jump into something like this, check down below. There are tutorials, either two at a time or one at a time socks that you knit from toe up with an after thought heel, the one that you cut the yarn. Now, definitely, if you want me to maybe design a more free knitting socks pattern, let me know down below. If I will have a pile of comments, that will definitely motivate me to knit more and actually have an idea for like very quite simple but delicate socks with a heart color work motif. Let me know would you be interested to knit that. Anyway, if you're looking for the pattern per se, the links is down below. Check my patterns rarely for sure. And uh, the pattern is written for four sizes, one, two, three, four. And if you knitted socks before, we're talking over here 48, 56, 64, and 72 stitches. That how many sizes you can knit having this beautiful color work. And this is color work, and I'm talking about stranded color work. So you hold two strands together to achieve this, and therefore there are charts to follow. I think in the beginning over here, I give you two options with a darker background, like I have over here, or a lighter background. But then we're moving to a leg section. You have charts for a darker background, so that's that. The gauge over here, because it's a fingering weight yarn, uh, it's 32 stitches by 40 rounds, so we're talking about eight stitches per one inch. But like I said, go with the flow with your instincts and with the number of stitches that you feel comfortable to knit a pair for yourself. Like I said, 48, 56, 64 or 72 stitches. For instance, as you can see, this is a medium blocker. I knitted size two, 56 stitches, and for that, for those these two pairs, I used over 60 grams and we have two colors and the darker color I used 45 grams and for the lighter color I used 15 grams. But it depends on the length of your foot um, and obviously size that you pick. It may change a little bit. However, you don't have to stick just to colors. You, you can play with any colors you want. You can go with one color over here, another color over here and then another over here. I have knitted socks for giveaway, so check it out uh, on this one for this month. Every month I'll try to knit socks to give it away, and I use this pattern. However, uh, this motif I also have with my paid-for pattern, but a different main chart I have for my new paid-for pattern, which is uh, this one, single leaf hat. If you like that, check it out. I've knitted also a socks for a giveaway for August 2021, so if you're watching it now, or later, you know, and on the screen and check it out. That's for members. So that's join button, next subscription button, which you can notice while you're watching this channel on your PC computer. Therefore, I used US size one, 2.25 millimeter needles to knit these socks. However, it depends on your tension. Some people might use US size 1.5, which is 2.5 millimeter knitting needles. So like I said, you need to try to knit for socks and you will know how do you like it? How do you like the, the fabric that it's created? It's too tense, it's quite okay, or it's too loose. Um, so check it out if you are a beginner knitter. And I would say, go for it. It's just, if you're a beginner knitter, go for it because it will literally, at the beginning, you will learn basics for the strands. So you just change the color every round and then you knit. And this section, which is a good introduction, you will have a section to practice and then you'll be changing to something more interesting and later on. So quickly, what yarn I use. I use uh, these two. I'm not going to tell you what kind of brand it is because it's not the most important thing. Like I said, it's fingering weight yarn or some call it sock weight yarn. Something with a big, big contrast will definitely be nice. And as you can see, I still have some leftovers and this is not from 100 gram because previously I knitted this headband and this is kind of talk through tutorial how to do it on this channel too. So I'm going to link it over here. Well, quickly, Check it out down below, leave me a comment. Uh, would you be interested for me to maybe design heart, color work sock, and enjoy your rest of the day. Till the next one, bye. Ooh, and share this video with your friends. Mm -hmm.